Yo, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be doing a video about a bunch of news-related stuff in Fortnite. Uh, so, basically, I think what I'm going to be doing from now on is a lot of news-related topics, because Fortnite is very sweaty right now. Uh, I c obviously, so I'm probably going to be doing Arena. But, uh, there's going to be a lot of it that's going to be news-related, because I like ne making news videos and uh, telling you guys what's new in Fortnite. So, uh, there's probably going to be a new type of series. Not really series, but... Uh, of me just telling you guys news uh, daily for Fortnite, it's not gonna be like a uh, daily news, but like it's gonna be like uh, some type of I don't know. I need to come up with some type of name for it, but uh, basically news-related topics in Fortnite. So um, yeah, let's hop into the first one. So the first one that we're gonna be talking about is the one that just happened today. Uh, so basically, they fortified Retail Row. So this is what um, Hypex said, and I said as well on my Twitter. Retail Row is the latest POI to get fortified after Sweaty Pleasant Park and Misty Meadows. This could be to keep the Primal out or the Raptors out. So, personally, in my opinion, I think it's going to be the, just to keep the Raptors out uh, because a lot of this started happening on that update when the Raptors did come into the game. So that's what I personally think, though. It could be uh, to make sure that their town does not become Primal because it seems like these are people that they're worrying about, all, you know, sweaty, Misty Meadows, Pleasant. Uh, it seems like they're people that they're worrying about that are, like, Primal and that are going to make their whole entire time problem. That's what I think is personally going to happen. Uh, but yeah, it's pretty interesting over there. So the next thing that we're going to be talking about is uh, the crafting materials either scrapped or uh, this could be materials for future, uh, the future of Fortnite. So as you can see on the screen here, it says Hot Flopper with a mechanical bow which can make a shockwave bow. Spicy Fish with the primal bow can make a flame bow, which would be pretty interesting. And then a pepper. Uh, with a primal bow would make a flame bow as well. So I don't know if that's going to be what they're looking for. Uh, if that's going to be in the future of Fortnite. It seems like they're mostly just consumable items. So I don't really know if it's going to be in the future of Fortnite. Or if these were just scrapped crafting items. Which a lot of people think they are. So another thing that just came out today is house party streaming of uh, Fortnite. So this is actually the promotional image that they posted on their Twitter account. Uh, and on the news tab in if you go into game you can actually see it. Um, basically, you can stream to your friends on House Party Fortnite. So if you're playing Fortnite on mobile, per se, on Samsung, and you're on House Party, you can stream it to your friends, and you can see your friends, and uh, it, it's just pretty interesting. Um, they just added this today, which could be mean that there could be more collabs with uh, House Party very, very soon, as it seems like they are still partnered together somewhat, and uh, th this is pretty cool. And as we saw in the past, they actually did partner together and they made it a wrap. So uh, you could get the wrap if you, there was a certain amount of people that were playing or on House Party and Fortnite. I don't really know. I forgot the ones our details of it. But that did happen before, so there's a chance that there could be more free rewards with House Party if that were to happen. So as we know about the Batman and Fortnite X, X Zero Point and uh, all, all the uh, comics that are going to be coming out, with DC in the future. This is actually a leaked pickaxe, the upcoming Catwoman pickaxe. Uh, this was leaked. I actually, it happened uh, a little bit ago, but uh, I'm just reporting on it now. So, uh, this is the pickaxe that's supposed to be for Catwoman. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be pretty interesting because if this is going to happen, then there's probably going to be one of these. This is probably going to be one of the free rewards uh, if you get the comic, which is like, I think, $5, I think. So, if you would be interested in getting the comic, it would be You'd be getting a lot of free uh, rewards. I think you'd get an extra style for Harley Quinn if you have her. You can get this free pickaxe most likely. Uh, probably a lot of stuff. So Catwoman may be getting a new style. Ba I know Batman's getting a new style. I know Harley Quinn's getting a new style for sure. Uh, that's already confirmed. But uh, it's pretty interesting considering that there's a comic book. And uh, it's just all going to happen. So this could be an upcoming Catwoman pickaxe for the, you know, the future of Fortnite. Or this could be for the comics. So Fortnite actually did a survey for Fortnite crew uh, to help you know, build it up and have it be good. So, this is what they actually said in the blog post. With a new survey being sent out, there are even more options for future Fortnite crew features that Epic is deciding. Epic Games Store coupons, save the world benefits, and benefits for non-Fortnite games. So, I'm actually going to read off the picture right now. Bundles with other subscriptions, like streaming services, Epic Games Store benefits like monthly coupons or special offers. Fortnite Save the World benefits, uh, PVE ca campaign access and new Save the World Heroes benefits like currency or cosmetics for other games. So obviously this is just trying to improve the Fortnite crew and have more people I think would buy it. And uh, yeah, this is pretty interesting. 
And, uh, yeah, it, th that was not from the blog post, by the way. I said the blog post accidentally. Uh, this was actually from Fire Monkey, so shout out to him. I'm going to be leaving his description. Uh, I'm going to leave all the leakers that I use in the description box below. Uh, so, yeah, it's pretty interesting stuff. Overall, they're just trying to improve the Fortnite crew, which is pretty cool because I personally have the Fortnite crew. You already get a free skin. You already get 3,000 V-Bucks. You already get the Battle Pass automatically. There's a lot of stuff, but they're obviously going to try and uh, make it better either way. So this is the last final thing that we'll be talking about. So uh, the next update's new NPC is going to be Spark Plug. Uh, the locations for Spark Plug will be Lazy Lake, Weeping Woods, or Power Dam. Uh, I have no clue where Power Dam is. But uh, services, uh, which means what she does for you. Uh, they, she can upgrade and sell 8 mechanical parts. Interactions image below. So default message, one man's wreck is the girl's pile of potential. First in interactions, need a tune-up, fresh paint job. What? Visited on dummy. Hope you haven't crashed another one. So uh, basically, if you were the dummy skin, then you would go up to the spark plug, and you know spark plug will obviously be the technician. So she's gonna say that if you do wear the dummy skin. So pretty cool. Uh, brand new NPC in Fortnite. Probably gonna come in the next update, which is actually next week. Which uh, I actually have a picture of what's gonna come in next week's update, uh, which is gonna be the recycler weapon. And uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty cool stuff to to think about that uh, there's gonna be a new weapon next week and there's gonna be a lot of stuff in that update so um yeah i'll be obviously either streaming it or making a video on it on the channel either way it's gonna be quickly uploaded so uh make sure you're on the channel make sure you're here for it and uh yeah it's gonna be pretty cool stuff so yeah overall pretty good day of updates and uh news i hopefully will be doing this daily if i don't do it daily it won't be daily obviously and uh yeah here's the weapon of the here's the recycler weapon on screen here and um yeah, that's it for me. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to the post notifications. Hope you guys did enjoy this first episode of this. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.